Various light controllers optimally adapt your vehicle's headlamp light to an extremely broad range of road situations. The adaptive headlight follows the course of the road, depending on the steering angle. As a result, the inside area of curves is illuminated better. In tight curves or when turning, the respective turning lamp is also switched on to further enlarge the illuminated area. In this way, pedestrians can be seen more easily. This diversity of light control options enables optimum illumination of the road in a broad range of driving situations. The active blind spot detection warns of critical situations when changing lanes and thereby actively increases the safety, for example, on the freeway. Checking the surrounding area of the vehicle on the side and in the rear is especially important when changing lanes. However, depending on the situation, certain areas next to and behind the vehicle are not easy to see. Therefore, when the system is activated, the sensors in the rear bumper monitor an area behind and next to the vehicle. A display on the outside mirror will show whether vehicles are approaching from the rear or passing from a certain speed. If you activate the turn signal in such a situation and thereby indicate your intent to change lanes to the system, a warning will be displayed. The warning symbol on the outside mirror will begin to flash and the steering wheel will vibrate. You will thereby be intuitively supported to abort the lane change and prevent a possible collision. The deactivation of the turn signal will cancel the warnings, or as soon as no more vehicles are present in the critical area. The system thereby helps you to recognize possible dangers when changing lanes early and prevent them. The high beam assistant switches the high beams on and off, depending on the lighting conditions and the traffic situation. A sensor near the inside rearview mirror monitors an area in front of your vehicle for this purpose. The high beam assistant detects the headlights of oncoming traffic. The high beams are switched off. In addition, the high beam assistant also detects the tail lights of vehicles driving ahead. BMW Gesture Control enables a specially convenient operation of selected iDrive functions. A camera in the roof lining scans an area in front of the dashboard. Gestures performed in this area are detected by the system. Depending on the equipment, various functions can be operated. Incoming calls can be accepted. Move the index finger back and forth in the direction of the monitor screen. Incoming calls can be rejected. Swipe the hand across the breadth of the control display towards the passenger side. The volume can be increased. Move the hand with a forward extended index finger in a clockwise circular motion. The gesture will be recognized after approximately one circular movement. The volume can be reduced. Move the hand slowly with a forward extended index finger in a counterclockwise circular motion. Here too, the gesture will be recognized after approximately one circular movement. With the surround view camera, it is possible to turn the camera. Make a pinching movement with thumb and index finger and move the hand horizontally to the left or right. Additionally, it is possible to set a personally definable gesture. A favorite function, such as changing radio stations, can be chosen from a selection via iDrive 
and performed with the personal gesture. This variety of gestures makes driving even more convenient during a trip. BMW Gesture Control helps to reduce non-essential distractions from traffic conditions. Park Distance Control, PDC, supports you during parking and maneuvering. For this purpose, the system monitors the approach to an object. The approach is indicated with acoustic warning tones and can be shown schematically on the control display. The warning tones and display change continually with the distance between the vehicle and the object. The flat tire monitor detects inflation pressure loss while driving and will signal this as a flat tire. The system must be initialized with the correct tire inflation pressure before a flat tire can be detected. The initialization will be completed during driving. When a flat tire occurs, the diameter of the defective tire changes, which also affects its rotating speed. The defective tire turns more quickly. The flat tire monitor compares the rotating speeds of the wheels with each other. When inflation pressure loss occurs, it detects the change in the rotating speed of the defective tire. A flat tire is then indicated. Daytime pedestrian protection can help to prevent accidents with pedestrians at city speeds. The feature is a part of and has the same functionality within the Active Driving Assistant and Active Driving Assistant Plus options. It is camera-based and delivers acoustic and visual warnings. This system includes braking intervention. Here's how it works. While driving at city speeds, a camera located near the interior rearview mirror detects people in a certain range. A warning signals the risk of an accident and prompts the driver to intervene immediately, for example, by braking. If necessary, your vehicle may also automatically apply the brakes to help mitigate an impact. The only way to fully deactivate daytime pedestrian protection is to deactivate all intelligent safety systems by pressing and holding the intelligent safety button until the LED goes out. For more information about this topic or others, you can download our Genius app, call the BMW Genius hotline, or ask a BMW Genius at your nearest BMW center. And to see future how-to videos, be sure to subscribe to our channel.